In the world of fashion, there are some incredibly amazing innovations. What do you think about a dress using neurotechnology? It changes color based on brain waves transmitted through one of the world's first brain computer interfaces with 1,024 channels. The dress is called pangolin or lizard, probably due to the resemblance of its scales to the mammals. The data collected from sensors are processed, analyzed, and then transformed into signals that illuminate 32 neopixels and 32 servo-powered scales. The principle is something like this. The higher the brain activity, the more they light up, the scales were 3D printed. The 3D printed dresses were the first demonstration of Agalus 30 material from Stratasys, which has extreme flexibility and durability and represents a big step forward for 3D printed fashion design. Esper Bionics has unveiled the Esper Hand, a self-learning bionic prosthetic limb with built-in artificial intelligence. It autonomously identifies muscle activity and predicts the force and range of intended movement. Weighing 380 grams, it is one of the lightest prosthetic hands in the world, and its responsiveness is three times faster than any comparable device. There are 10 million people worldwide with upper limb amputations. Most prosthetics offer weak cosmetic effects and do not fully replicate all functions of the removed limb. In contrast, the Esper Hand prosthetic with intuitive control is regulated by artificial intelligence. The bionic hand features an elegant and natural anatomical design available in five sizes. It is sturdy and functional with five movable fingers and a flexible wrist that allows users to perform even the most delicate daily tasks. Communication between the device and the human brain occurs through the Esper Control Neurocomputer Interface. The robotic prosthetic is equipped with non-invasive sensors that read and process muscle activity and brain signals to trigger the desired movements in the prosthetic. Developers claim that the more intensively the user practices, the more accurately and quickly the smart hand comprehends repeated movement algorithms and learns to anticipate them. The Tokyo-based company Jitai, founded in 2016 by Sho Nakanos, is developing robots for work in space and on the surface of the moon. In 2021, the company successfully conducted its first product demonstration on the International Space Station. A subsequent demonstration beyond the ISS is expected in 2024. GTI has secured $47 million in investments from major venture capital funds for the development of its robots, along with projects with the Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency and Toyota. But that's not all. Nekanos plans to provide thousands of robots for missions on the Moon and Mars. The creator believes that through their work, space exploration will become more accessible and practical as it eliminates the risks to human beings. Their use of robots in space missions instead of humans will reduce the cost of operations by 100 times, according to the startup founder. GTI produces two products. The first is a two-meter robot resembling a caterpillar. It moves like the insect and can be equipped with attachments such as a drill or shovel to perform various tasks, reducing the situations in which astronauts need to go into open space. These tasks include repairs and maintenance of spacecraft or stations. The second product is a rover the size of a card. With a range for a one-way trip of several miles, it can navigate the lunar surface, Nakanos explains. This ability is important as NASA plans to return humans to the moon and establish a permanent presence there. The Paris-based company Enchanted Tools hopes to stand out among other robot developers with its mobile robots Maroki and Maroka, inspired by the creativity of the Pixar Animation Studio. The robots have pointed ears and expressive cat-like faces. Maroki and Maroka have been designed for use in hospitals, nursing homes, and hotels to assist in moving objects. Both robots function similarly, with the only difference being that Maroki is a boy and Maroka is a girl. According to Enchanted Tools, the robots can grasp objects using specially designed handles attached to trays with a success rate of 97%. They navigate using a rotating sphere. The company has partnered with the Broca Hospital in Paris and announced that this elderly care hospital will be one of the first where Moruki will be used publicly in 2024. The robot will be able to perform tasks such as bringing water to patients, clearing trays with meals in hospital cafeterias, delivering gloves or other personal protective equipment to doctors, the company stated. On the Enchanted Tools website, it is mentioned that the robot weighs 26 kilograms, stands at a height of 1.23 meters, has a maximum speed of 3.2 kilometers per hour, a carrying capacity of 3 kilograms, and its battery provides 8 hours of operation. 
The Ultra Blue Mobile Robot offers a unique solution to automated truck loading in that it can autonomously drive to and from dock doors into truck trailers without additional infrastructure. No rails or in-ground equipment are required, making this a flexible solution that can operate in a variety of warehouse layouts. Once at a trailer, Ultra Blue transports, lifts and places individual boxes or cases directly into the trailer. Ultra Blue can be integrated into approved existing material handling equipment such as telescopic conveyors, flexible powered conveyors, carton erectors, inline case, weighing systems, sortation systems, barcode scanners, depalletizing systems, and more. The robot performs these steps without human labor intervention or lifting of loads. This opens opportunities for associates to be better leveraged for more important and non-repeatable tasks. The future of parking vehicles has reached a whole new level. Intelligent parking robots are now readily available to park vehicles smartly and efficiently. Smart parking has been a developing concept for a while now, but Jimu has taken the leap. Jimu has constructed the future of parking. This smart and fully autonomous parking is unlike anything you have ever seen. Intelligent parking robots are a smart and efficient parking system. These robots have developed software and algorithms. They have made parking convenient for drivers. Parking robots are uniquely made with two pieces. The design has center positioned robot arms and differential driving units. The driver only has to put the required parameters on a screen at a transfer zone. The robots then take the vehicle from there without creating any trouble for the driver. The German company Drone Champions League tested the Big Drone, a piloted drone capable of performing aerobatic maneuvers with a person on board. From time to time, DCO had increased the size of drones, but even relatively large compared to amateur quadcopters, they slipped out of sight at speeds of about 160 km per hour. It is kept in the air by 12 large propellers. The 98 kg device reaches speeds of up to 140 km per hour, with a total power of 220 horsepower from its electric motors. The max the maximum payload is 167 kilograms, meaning inside the big drone, one passenger in protective gear can comfortably fit. During the first test flight, a mannequin took a place in the cockpit. With it on board, the big drone performed a variety of aerobatic maneuvers, turns, rolls, flips, and more. The Chinese company Hypershell has developed the Omega Exoskeleton, which stands out from its counterparts by being controlled by artificial intelligence. The exoskeleton increases the performance of its wearer's movements during hikes and walks, allowing them to do so without the need for energy drinks. With it, people without special training can become tireless explorers and travelers. The device weighs only 2 kilograms, can be folded into a compact form and attached to a backpack. When needed, it can be worn around the waist and adjusted according to the specific individual's needs. Needs. Inside the exoskeleton, there is an 800-watt electric asynchronous motor providing biomechanical support that compensates for up to 30 kilograms of the wearer's body weight. This enables people to walk and carry loads with significantly less effort. Write in the comments what you think about these new generation technologies. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like it and subscribe to the Kara Show channel. Also, check out our previous videos. See you next time.